Welcome to Five Fires YouTube. Today we're gonna have an adventure over here at Disneyland. Let's fire it up. We still got some resemblance of Halloween that has made it to November 1st. Inside the theme park, there's already icicles and lots of uh, lanyards and everything going up for Christmas time. But thankfully I brought my magic band. We're gonna bleep bloop blop our way. Hopefully at some point in time we get a, a magic band line where you don't have to take photos because when you get a photo or you have to get a photo for a day ticket. But with the magic bands, you just go bloop. We'll see if it ever comes. Feels so good to be inside Disneyland. It's November. We're so close to Christmas. <laughs> we got a big day ahead of us. We're going to check out a lot of new merch. A lot of the decorations that have gone up for Christmas time. We're just gonna have a fun day at Disneyland. Let's fire it up. And there it is, everybody. It is gone. Corella DeVille. <laughs> it is gone. Mickey Blinky is gone, has left the building, but we have lots of snow, icicles. We got signs of Christmas coming all throughout uh, Main Street. We're gonna cover it all. We are gonna cover it all. Before we get our day started, we're waiting for the marching band to come to the railroad. They do have a moment that starts at 12 o'clock at the castle and then goes all the way to the Disneyland Railroad. But I wanna go to the Emporium and see if anything's new Christmas-wise. Beginning, or bringing the Mary. It's already busy in here. <laughs> oh, they took it out. It's so nice. That's a new t-shirt. Season's greeting. Okay. We got homeware now for Disney Home. Christmas time. What are these? First time I'm seeing this. Oh, it's to make like waffles maybe a big chocolate chip cookie just imagine new christmas cocoa popcorn wow that sounds good i can see like marshmallows in there maybe even peppermint and then what are these crisp rice cereal treats okay i know these have been super hot a lot of people have been buying this starbucks mug Anytime there's a new one, everybody buys. You got the Christmas stuff coming out too. <laughs> this is at the Emporium. Uh, this is all new from my last trip. It's a set of four right there. Wow. We got a lot of stuff to cover today, that's for sure. Oh my Lanta, we got the new plushies too. Minnie Mouse. This one is 30 bucks. And then Mickey as well is here. This one is 30 bucks as well.
They only do that once a day, so try to catch that. It's such a magical moment. They make it to the railroad around 12.10 or so, but set up around 12 o'clock, because that was worth every minute. These have also arrived. Chippendale. It's so cute. Look how cheap these are. 35 bucks. Today is the first day for these tie-dye ears. That's what I'm gonna call them. And they're 35 bucks. We're still on Main Street and I wanted to see if there was any like Halloween treats still available and there is. They got the apples. They got the mummy. And then the cake pop, the Rice Krispie Treat. So a little bit of Halloween still making it to November 1st. All the pumpkins are gone at the partner statue. Made our way down to the castle. As you can see, it's full of icicles, snow. It actually has blue mirrors, or not blue windows in the middle. And at nighttime, after fireworks, it lights up just like it would look like at Christmas. It's pretty impressive already. I can't, I can't be here tonight, but we'll definitely be back soon and cover everything on November 11th. That's the big day. So if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe because that's where we're going to be covering Christmas from Disneyland and California Adventure. There's a lot to cover come that day. I'm curious to know what characters are coming out now because it's not Halloween, so it's not villains and stuff, you know? We do have some Christmas decorations going up now at the Royal Theater. And don't forget, they are doing the shows now. I think one's about to start. Even over here by Rancho de Zocalo, all coming alive. Came in to check out some of the new pins. You got Jafar. I don't even know what that's all about. Mirror Birds. We got Minnie Mouse. We're checking out what's new over here and check out that small world. First time seeing that. So Christmas pins are arriving everywhere. I know I've seen these, but now we got these right here. Oh, Haunted Mansion Holiday. Oh, that one's cool. Wow. Christmas decorations have now gone up over here at Pioneer Mercantile as well. And right across at the shooting range too. And what's cool, one of the Halloween things that still made it is the Halloween tree still up over there. So we'll see if we can look at that, <laughs> the remaining pumpkins. But we're gonna check out Pioneer Mercantile, see if anything's new inside. This one has just arrived. It's a Christmas wand with bubbles and it is 32, pretty much 33 bucks. Also taking a look at some of the magic bands. Have a Falcon one. This new Gru one. Yeah, there's just gonna be new versions coming left and right. Here we got a Black Panther version as well. And they're limiting it two per guest. And then this one arrived too. We found these at Pioneer Mercantile, first time seeing them. Uh, Minnie and Mickey Nutcrackers, 13 inches. They're being sold for 65 bucks though. Also, too, I finally get to showcase these. These sold out right away the last time I was here. Uh, new Santa ears with the Mickey ears. And then they have this new version of Mickey ears as well, uh, where it like Velcro's on the back, so you don't want them to fall off. You don't want them to fall off when you get on Small World. You know, it's pretty intense on that ride. <laughs> Check this out with Mickey's on it. It's like a spirit jersey poncho and it has a hoodie as well. And it's very thick uh, material that you are not gonna be cold in this. And we are coming to uh, winter season. What do you think, villain? I like it, I'm gonna get it myself. <laughs> it's fire. And it has the pockets in the front too, right here. It's like a, it's like a, like a sweatshirt hoodie, but with like a poncho feel. For $65, yeah, dude. dude. I, I don't know if Disney mispriced this, but the way everything going out here, you would have thought this is like 100, 130 bucks. This fluffy polka dot pink has arrived not too long ago as well, but these Crocs are new. They don't have pricing. Last time we checked though, they were 65. 
Jesse's been doing a lot of the just putting a barcode. <laughs> You'll find out at the register. And then they also have this throw as well. They're calling it Plaid Manta. Okay. Christmas decorations now going up over here at the Golden Horseshoe. And we're gonna make our way to Cafe Orleans, New Orleans Square. Cause there's a lot going on over there too. Still no word on what's gonna happen with the tree house. It's almost like we're done speculating on that. <laughs> we gotta wait for Disney to say something. We have a Pirates at 40 minutes. It is one o'clock in the day. Stroller land. All right, so we're gonna try to make our way that way. <laughs> Making our way now by Cafe Orleans. We already have Santa's. The moon Santa's so cool. And pretty much this whole street, Christmas. We're at the Haunted Mansion store and they have this Lego Haunted Mansion. I thought it was sold out for a while, but it's available now for 40 bucks. We're still doing the meeting grades, Jack and Sally. It's gonna look so cool at night in here. Oh look, they have the lights on over there. Ah, oh, they do have the lights on. It's a lot of fun just finding out where all the decorations went up overnight now being November 1st, French Market. That was like some nightmare inspired stuff. I feel like it hasn't been too busy, but this is 75 minutes. <laughs> 75 minutes. Even though it's November 1st, Halloween has disappeared. Mickey's Mixed Magic projections are set to start today. And that one weekend we're gonna have before hol uh, holidays is gonna be fireworks with Mickey's Mixed Magic. So that's gonna be a lot of fun. We did take a look at how long Splash Mountain was. 60 minutes. Look at the critical. Christmas. So we're on the hunt today for all the decorations. We got some here now at Hungry Bear as well. We're gonna go all the way down to Pooh Corner. Maybe Pooh's out. Even though it's a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday out here at the parks, it seems like every day has become a Saturday in regards to crowds. It's just busy every day at Disneyland. <laughs> oh, my God. I barely walked through Splash Mountain. I'm trying to get, I see Winnie the Pooh and Eeyore out right now for a meet and greet. Splash Mountain already got their Christmas decorations out. This, this is crazy. We're like maybe 24 well, hours from the full on Christmas. I'm still Halloween, yeah. dog. I haven't even transitioned yeah. over. You got the wrong stuff on, dude. <laughs> yeah. oh, no. yeah. It's Christmas, dog. <laughs> Man, it's crazy. Just Christmas decorations everywhere. We need the poo. We need the poo. And Tigger. <laughs> Tigger. Oh. Aww. Let's see if anything is new at Pooh Corner. I haven't been in here in a minute. So who would have thought the first Christmas tree up in Pooh Corner. And it's the carrot tree. It has lots of carrots everywhere. Those of you around the cannon business get the back. All right, we are on the way to Batu. Heard some Life Day stuff has arrived. We're gonna go check it all out. <laughs> I know this is nothing new, but this is a Tuesday. At 1.43, the line is out here for Rise of the Resistance. It's just crazy every day, Doc. <laughs> this, is, this is actually a good thing. I seen it go down now. <laughs> in a critter, actually a good thing. In a critter country. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If I had to take a wild guess, this is hour and a half, maybe. Somewhere in that range. And it also depends, too, how many uh, individual lightning lanes are kind of going. Because that's, 
That's what hits standby the worst. We all wish we could get some decorations in Batu, but I don't think that's gonna happen. We're gonna go check out the Life Day stuff. It's at the marketplace. One thing I forgot now that it's November is Mando Where's is Mando coming. At? Where's Mando at? And Grogu. So Mando and Grogu meet and greet. Mm. They said November. No date has been announced. I'm guessing we're any day now. They're going to announce day, something. Yeah. But yeah, just imagine we're going to have Mando. Do you think they'll have Boba walking out here with Mando? Because they, no. they were in the same show. Second they were in Boba Fett. The only thing I'll tell you is personally, if I have to give like a like an estimation, I think November 11th, they're gonna drop just everything, everything huh? Yeah. yeah. Mbaku's dropping that day. Yeah. Wakanda, Christmas. Yeah. Why, why Bando, not? They're gonna, they're gonna yeah. Give characters DCA, why not give uh, one to Baku? Just everything at the same yeah, time. That's yeah. what I think. That's so pro me. probably November 11th, everybody. Surprisingly, a lot of people are doing the bounty hunter experience still, and that's with the magic band. Today, at about two o'clock, Smuggler's Run is 50 minutes, and do not forget, this ride does have single rider. You won't get the pilot seat, but hey, you get on the ride right away if you're able to do single rider. It is two o'clock. Yeah, we got Kylo Ren, Stormtroopers. information. I don't care if you get it from a pirate, a thief, or a traveler, but get it. Am I clear, Lieutenant? You're clear, sir! Finishing up with Galaxy's Edge. Trying to make our way through Fantasyland, which is always crazy. We heard Moana might be coming out over here by Small World, so we're gonna go see if we can find her. Made her way to Small World, and we got the Santa hat and Lily Bell off in the distance. I can't believe we're so close to Christmas time over here at Disneyland Resort. We're doing the meet and greet. Mickey and Minnie just came out. And then we got Mickey. We got to be Berta. So cool. She's over here by Small World. And we have a princess here. Hello there. What's your name? During this time before November 11th, make your way out to the Small World area. Those are all the characters. Are I guess Aladdin and Princess Jasmine might be coming out as well. And we have Mickey and Minnie in the back. Just met Merida. And then we have Moana, so cool. Definitely check out Moana over here by Small World. I'm not sure if this is just a today thing, but it's so cool. She actually came out around 2.30. Hey, no Calvacade. We got that confirmed, but the character's well, doing yeah, meet and greets. We got Moana, Mickey, Minnie. Yeah, and, and then uh, there's Aladdin. wood on the street. I think we might get more characters that usually come out of the cavalcade. Yeah, just hang out on this area. That's, that's cool. cool. Well, you know what that tells me is that Gaston. Find the wife. Marry me. We're gonna get her to marry you. Yeah, you're hitting the gym hard, huh? Yeah. Or is this on that Yeah, Gaston. Hey, Gaston wakes up like this. <laughs> hey, Gaston wakes yeah. up like this, man. Yeah, what are you talking about? Perfect. Yeah. Hey, a couple of eggs, a couple of bacon. Try to read That's a book. All That's all you need. Yeah, he wakes up looking as good. Hey, the gym doesn't beat you up. You beat up the gym. That's right. Well, he takes it all pretty well, so. What do you do?
That is it for today's adventure over here at Disneyland. We're gonna keep up with the updates, more merch, the foods, the characters. There's gonna be a lot to cover very soon come November 11th, but I had a lot of fun. I do wanna say one thing, no cavalcade freed up the characters to do meet and greets all over Disneyland. And it almost seemed like Disneyland was way more alive today. So is the cavalcade a good thing or a bad thing? I almost kind of want to say it's a bad thing. The amount of meet and greets we saw today and characters out was awesome. I loved every minute of it. But thank you everybody for watching Fire Fires YouTube. Don't forget to smash that like button on the way out. And thank you for supporting the fire. We are farting it down, farting it down. The Cali Bay is calling it a day. I'm the main host, Mondo. Oh! <sighs>